Oh, I, okay, I guess. So anyways, I'm just gonna say that you can actually use your mouse to move this around or use the arrow keys and space bar. I prefer the arrow keys and space bar personally, so I'm just gonna do that. I quite enjoy this puzzle or game, whatever you want to call it. One of my favorites. There's not a lot to talk about. It's more just concentrating on what you're doing and uh, hope you don't screw up. Because I haven't screwed this puzzle up in a long time. So I'm going to just probably do it today just to jinx myself. a long song. Hey, we did it! Yeah! Brilliant! Here's your share of the tips. Five tips. Nice. Five, five things. Sweet as clover to the honeybee that was. Mm. Here's the book. Keep mm. it as long as you'd like. No, you'll not soon have need of it. Thank you. Will you be wanting something else from me then? I'd better get going. Be careful out there, lass. Hmm, trust me, I will. Alright. So we now have the book. And let's go and solve this, this stone pillars puzzle. This is it's such an easy puzzle. If you just get like one pillar down, then yeah, it's uh, it's it, it is quite an easy puzzle. Not my favorite puzzle. I remember back in when I was younger and was playing this for the first time. My dad and I spent hours trying to figure this puzzle out. Could not. Oh, shooting star. Make a wish, guys. Made my wish. We good. All right. Uh, so this needs to be Summer Tree and Taurus Constellation. So Summer Tree... Would be this one. I think that's already Taurus right there. Where's the uh, constellations? Taurus. Alright, good. Um, actually, this one needs to have... Yeah, this, this pillar is done. Now, the, uh, the next, uh, just sort of figuring it out. Uh, this needs to have the fall tree. That's good. And the uh, Leo constellation, which is this one. We'll figure this one out in a little bit. This needs to have the winter tree. And this needs to have the spring tree. This needs to have that one, I think. Scorpius. And that. And then we just sort of figure this bottom part. Unless, hold on. Scorpius is the snake. Oh. There we go. So now it's just more, more figuring this part out. I know this cannot be like that. This cannot be like... There we go. There we go. So basically, the the combination to all this, uh, this is the, the uh, first pillar, second pillar, third pillar, and fourth pillar. And that's it. That's just plain old it. So what do we do now? Oh, of course. We need to go talk to Kyler. Whoops. Man, I'm getting really hungry. I need to get my uh, buttered chicken from last night. Mmm. So good, man. We got this amazing Indian restaurant that's not too far away from us. And we just ordered in last night. You have a lead? Mostly Holy a cow. The food they make is incredible. This sketch? I found it outside. It looks like a drawing for some kind of housing development for the land the castle sits on. Apparently Kit did them. Did you ask him to? No, and I seriously doubt Matt did either. Kit must have done those on his own. The question is... question is, why, why not? 
Anyway, I thought of something else you can do for me. Yes. Since there's a possibility, however remote, that there are forces at work around here that none oh of us gosh. completely understands, I think it only prudent to do what I can to counteract them. Oh my gosh, that superstitious. End, I would like to include these herbs and flowers in my wedding bouquets. All right. According to Irish law, each of them is believed to be associated with things I could use a little more of right now. All right. If you could pick them for me and put them in that vase over there, that vase. would be wonderful. Here's a basket. Basket. Thank you this, very much. Of course, means that in spite of whatever it was I saw in the nursery, we saw in the nursery. I still believe there will indeed be a wedding. We'll make no sure of it, Kyler. What took Matt? You're going to find him, Nancy. That's right. I have to believe that. Please don't let me down. I'll catch you later. Keep me posted. All right, guys. This is one of my favorite parts of the game. We are going to find some flowers. It's really simple. You pretty much just have to look everywhere and every location that you can go to. And that's just what we're going to do. Oh, whoops. So let's hop into here. Uh cannot take those flowers we can take a rose though or some roses because we need those and we got to go all the way along to not there uh, but past that to this weird ring I'll take some of those and then we'll go down to the bog a couple flowers we can get down there oh that's the edge of the map okay uh, that's also the edge of the map. Here we go. Uh, we'll take these. And then in the bog, we will take... That. And then we'll head over to where we need to go next. Let's head to the front gates. How many more flowers do we need? Do we need two? Oh, but we need three. Okay. Oh, I know where they are. So there's uh, this one. We'll take that. And then we'll keep walking all the way along over this way. Till we get to here. And then we'll take these. And then we'll take... The final flowers, which are actually at the stone pillars. By the way, actually, I guess uh, for those of you guys that feel adventurous, if you walk along this road this way uh, for a little while, then you'll actually get to the inn, uh, the scre Screaming Banshee Inn, but it's just faster to press on the Baylor sign. So just in case some of you guys wanted to know, but I don't think anyone really wanted to know because they probably already knew that, because most likely whoever watches this has probably played and beat this game before. So. There we go. I think that is it. That's it. Nice. Let's go talk to Kyler. Oh, there. That friggin' sound, man. That's such a weird sound. Yeah. Oh! Oh my gosh, Kit is near. Wait, what? Luggage? Matt Simmons! What? Okay, we're. Kyler, guess what? We need to talk. Those were just some sketches I made because oh, what? I was bored. I do that all the time. I'm not after your property. Then what are you after? Nothing! But why are you trying to tell me there's not going to be a wedding? Because Matt is gone. Matt would never walk out on me. Never. He still loves you, Kyler, but he's not ready to get married, and he just didn't know how to tell you. Oh, so he told you to tell me. Or was his leaving your idea? Would you tell him, Kit, that I still had feelings for you, that it isn't over between us? Because it is. You know that, don't you? It is most definitely over. Did Matt ever tell you about the girl who did it just before you? The man does love his pizza. Yes, yes. I better not go in there. Yeah, that was... Wow, okay, so... 